Okay, in this next problem, I can't think of it as negative 3 copies of negative 4. But I can use that, that trick that I showed you earlier. Remember, if we have the same sign, if we're multiplying factors that have the same sign, in this case I have two negative numbers that are multiplying together. Since they are the same sign, these two negative numbers will cancel out and create a positive product in the long run. Well, how can I prove this? Well, let's just cover up both of these negative signs for a second. In fact, I'm going to use my dark highlighter and just pretend that I'm, I'm covering them up with the shade real quick. Let's just focus on the two factors, 3 times 4. 3 times 4 gives us a value of 12. Now I can unshade uh, both of these highlights. I'm going to do it one at a time. Well, when I unshade this first highlight, I'm going to think about this value, the product, as the opposite of positive 12. So we're again, remember, 3 times 4 is 12. I'm going to remove the highlighter, and now my positive 12 should turn into a negative 12 because it's the opposite. I'm using that negative sign. However, I have another negative sign that's covered up, so when I remove this highlighter, I'm going to take the opposite of negative 12, which gives me a value of positive 12 again. So the answer here is positive 12. The shortcut is just remember that two negative numbers when multiplied together create a positive.